evening all today we're going to kick ourselves in the ballocks lol anyways <laughs> what today we're looking at um is actually officer guns now there is a kind of thing at the moment where people are using officer gear uh certainly a lot more i think also with the player market about to be opened up there is going to be quite a trade in these kind of officer weapons so i thought i mean i've actually never really used them in fact i've never used them um and today this video is actually the first time i've ever used one um it's only because i noticed i actually could use the ballocks so I thought, well, let's give it a go. Um, I don't, people have asked me my opinion on officer stuff. And to be honest, I don't have a problem with people using officer stuff in any match, to be honest with you. I think if you have um, the desire to run you know, these kind of weapons and you, you want to do it, then all power to you. Um, this game is more like Eve than anything else, so don't expect anything to be fair. Um, sitting back and saying, well, you're using officer gear, blah, 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 is a bit shit. And I've trolled a few people myself just because it's like, lol, you're using your thales against us, you know. Um, but I, I actually really don't have an issue with it. Um, and let's, ex let's examine that, because I think the funny thing about officer guns is, um, is they're obviously incredibly good, and they're obviously, you know, they obviously drop pretty much only from um, you know, winning matches or, or you know, the salvage from a winning a match, let's say. Um, although I noticed that you actually get salvage from losing matches now as well, so go for it. But um, did I get that wrong? Did you always? I always thought you only got ma uh, salvage from winnings. Anyway, so here we go. This is the thing firing. As you can see, very high rate of fire, very accurate, very deadly gun. And, um, you know, I can see that when the player market is opened up, which is obviously coming very soon, you're going to see some very rich assholes, maybe named CO Pirates Clone A, maybe, you know, with a lot of ISK. Um, running solely officer gear because maybe they kind of have a lot of air skin lol lol lo. to be honest I'm not going to do that but there certainly could be people who are going to do that who have probably quite a lot of uh, resources um, and they're just going to run continually ballocks because at the end of the day once you open up that market where you can buy and sell guns there's nothing or, or even give them away you know let's not forget that you're going to have this scenario where people are going to you know exclusively use um, officer gear a lot more so I think it's a sad part of the game um, that we're not going to kind of be able to control that. But again, it's not too sad because I think actually it will make the game a bit more interesting. So um, I see it as quite an exciting um, avastance of what's going to happen. So what happens starts rather. So I think, um, you know, personally, would I run Balex continually? No, I think they're obviously very good guns. To be honest, these are the kind of things you'd run a PC fit for. You know what I mean? You'd have a, a really kind of alpha, important, really super serious fit. Um, for pub matches, I probably would just run Devol because, and even then, it's debatable whether I'd run Devol because the Gex just as good. Do you know what I mean? It, there, there really has to be a limit at some point where you say to yourself, "Well, there's no point running a, a Gaston minigun, blah blah blah," because you know it's only it's only an ambush. Um, but then again, who knows? Uh, it, it's you know, post in the comments what your opinions of this are because I, I get kind of kind of ragey when you see like three dudes in a in a skirmish or a domination with little sniper rifles, um, but only from the point of view that I think, well, that's a bit of fun, and we actually then spend the majority of the map trying to kill them because hey, that would be fun. Um, <clears throat> it's a tricky one, but. I think from our point of view, in terms of how the officer guns are, they are obviously just in, you know, augmented enhanced versions of um, the normal gun. So obviously the Balax, there's obviously a dude called Balak. If you haven't read, there's some fan fiction <coughs> about him in the, um, I think it's on the Dust website, you'll have to check it out. But um, Balak was obviously some dude who, you know, modified an assault rifle, he made it ridiculously good, etc. Now, this is exactly how Eve is. Eve is exactly the same where you, ha you get like an officer shield booster. So this is some dude who sat on a ship, took his shield booster apart, you know, modified it a bit, played with it, stuck some tinfoil on it, and lo and behold, it's 20% better. Um, and I like this. I think this is always a cool part of, um, of CCP's knowledge of MMOs is, you know, to have like, you know, officer drops or whatever you call them in a, in a first person shooter is awesome. Um, I would love to see this extended. I'd love to see, <clears throat> you know, just as a throwing a suggestion out there, maybe Pyrex's Flaylock. Maybe, maybe. No, that was shameless. All right, I know. But, you know, you can have like an officer's. I'm not saying I'm an officer. I am the Lord of Dust. But <laughs> I think just somebody's like, um, you know, AR would be pretty cool, you know. Or, sorry, not AR. Um, somebody's Flaylog. Even the author things to sort of like, you know, maybe, you know, Zippy's amazing dropship. You know what I mean? That'd be pretty funny as well. Because I like the idea of officer vehicles. I like the idea of officer modules as well for the drop suit. I really would take this to his extreme. I really would, I think. <clears throat> I think this could be something that really, you know, um, 
again just makes the game a bit more deeper um it makes every death that bit more sweeter as well because seriously when i was running this thing i was scared of losing it usually i'm not terrified of losing anything because it is easy literally whereas you know this is something you can't buy something you can't replicate um, and once you've lost it, it's gone. And I think that was actually quite a big deal to me. So um, it made the game a lot more serious and a lot more heightened in its you know, severity. So GG to CCP for that, because I'd love to see this more extended into more things. I think um, officer gear is not to be kind of uh, hated and despised. If somebody kills you with a, you know, a, an officer heavy machine gun, then you know, that's, that's their risk. They're bringing it so they get an advantage. So, you know, you have to just basically say, well, to take that off them is going to be more satisfying than them killing me with it. Do you know what I mean? And I, I really do believe that. I believe that more than I've ever believed anything in this game, that there is nothing funnier in this game than when you, you kill somebody with a Thales and they obviously don't want to lose it because they run like a little girl. Well, there we go. I think, you know, as it stands, I think, you know, officer guns are obviously going to become a very big part of this game now. I think once an open market is established, you're going to have people <clears throat> who will literally just go and buy 100 Balaks and they will use them continually. So, you know, start to get used to this. I think some of the top players in the game who've got all the ISK in the world because they play continually are just going to really spam this like crazy. Um, and I think that gives you quite a drive to uh to combat them so i you know i really would stress i think this could be quite an epic um augmentation of the game more than it is now because i think when you look at other games as well they don't have this kind of officer style gun you know things like battlefield 4 has got something kind of similar a drop you pick up in the map but you don't keep it so i, I really think this is something that ccp have done exceptionally well i i look forward to seeing this being developed a lot more um, I, it, I would love to see more guns included, and I'm not kidding about the Pyrex Flaylock. Just, you know, subtle hint to CCP if they're watching. Pyrex is Flaylock, that'd be pretty funny, wouldn't it? Uh, <laughs> shameless, I know, shameless, but I've always been <laughs> I've always been of the opinion that, you know, fuck it, who cares? Uh, but I think, you know, certainly um, I'd love to see more modules as well. I think that'd be pretty cool to have some, you know, officer modules for um, shield, officer modules for damage, etc. Um, and maybe you don't just get one maybe it drops like 10 of them so you know again just think of the market again one of the key things and differentiators of eve was this glorious market so obviously that's coming to dust so maybe they need to give us more special speciality items that we can actually trade so you know i'm really quite excited about that <clears throat> So there we go, that was our Balax outing. I didn't lose it, I actually switched to shotgun um, about a quarter, you know, quarter towards the end. Um, but as my kind of you know, draw to a close on this one, I think, was you know, are the guns any good? I think yes. Are they going to be proliferated? Yes, without a doubt. You're going to see every match with a Gaston. You're going to see every match with a Thales and a Balax, etc. Um, hold on to them. I wouldn't sell them all just to begin with. What's going to happen is probably inflation. I think um, you know people will set low prices and they will just grow as, as supply starts to dwindle. I think at the moment there's a glut of them on the market, so obviously the price is going to be high. Um, and naturally, if you want to just give me all of your Balax uh, assault rifles, you can kindly donate them to me and I will love you eternally. Yes, that was begging. No, I'm not ashamed of myself. I'm going to go and kill some kittens now. Hope you enjoyed that. See you next time.